guys welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be doing a hair tutorial and this is basically what I do to get volume into my hair I have got fine thin hair which is two things that don't really usually go with having lots of volume in your hair so I'm going to show you today how I put some volume into my fine hair so I washed my hair this morning um, I did use a volumizing conditioner and the shampoo I used was just my husband's because it was in the shower and mine has run out. So when I got out of the shower, when my hair was soaking wet um, and I just sort of towel, um, towel it down, I put in some of the Tresemme Perfectly Undone. This is the Wave Creating Sea Foam. So I just put a good sized dollop into my hand and just sort of concentrated that sort of through these top parts of my hair. And then I also put in some of the Tresemme Perfectly Undone Sea Salt Spray. Um, now I find that this has got quite a huge amount comes out when you spray it directly into your hair. So I put some into my hand. So probably about four sprays into my hand. My hands together and I sort of really also concentrate that through there. And then I've let my hair... Um, what's the word? Just dry on its own. So I haven't put anything more like done anything more to it so I'll take my glasses off and I'm going to pop in some of the Tresemme heat tamer protective spray and just sort of run that through because we're going to be putting some heat on our hair so we want to protect it and just comb that through to distribute and I will just say that this video is not sponsored by Tresemme they're just the products that I find work well on my hair Okay, so products, things that you're going to need. You're going to need some little sectioning tongs to section off areas. Um, a round brush. Now this is, I think I might have got this from a chemist and I can't remember where, but it's um, a ball bristle brush. So, and it's got no nodules on the end. If you're going to be doing blow drying with hair, um, you want to get the round brushes that have no nodules on the ends at all, okay? And, of course, a hair dryer. I use the Baby Super Turbo 2.8, and this is a pro one, um, and it's also got the nozzle that comes off on the end. First, what I do is, because my hair is so fine, I really only sort of take this sort of chunk of hair and I section that off. Now, I'm not too particular with these bottom bits. Um, I just want to get the frizz out of them as such um, because you know these top bits are essentially going to cover up that area. So you want to brush through so you've got no tangles and um, I'm obviously going to turn the microphone off when I'm using the blow dryer but essentially what you want to be doing is taking a section of hair depending on how fine your hair or how thick your hair is. I usually take about a two inch section and you want to be blow drying sort of at an angle to your head. Not down here, you want to blow dry on here because you want all that volume. And you're sort of going to try and keep the brush in the hair to the end and then you're going to roll it back up and blow sort of like hot air or warm air into this sort of section here to get lots of volume. And then you can do that, you know, quite a few times just to get that nice sort of volume through your hair. When I finish doing sort of that sort of section, it's going to have that real bulb kind of look to it but don't stress um, once we sort of get to the end of the style that's when we can style it out it's just getting that volume into those roots part so um, I'll turn the microphone off and um, I'll show you how I just load around this bottom section
too fussed about which way it goes because I sort of don't really care about that sort of section as such. I just really want to get some volume up into here. Okay, so for this top section, um, I basically take from where sort of my brows arch and do a section back from there. So that's sort of sort of going to a point area. So I section that bit off. And then I work on these side bits. So same technique as before. I am a little bit more careful with this sort of section. So let's get into it. section and I'm really going to be focusing on bringing that hair all the way up. I hope you can see that there um, and really putting lots of volume into here. <laughs> Basically all I do now is I work out which way I want to sort of flip my hair and how I want it to sit, just have a bit of a play around with it. I usually grab a bit more of the sea salt spray and a couple of sprays into my hands and just sort of work it sort of through this top section and really getting it right into those roots. And I might also go in with my tail comb and just give a bit more volume. So as you can see, you know, it doesn't really matter what those bottom bits are doing because, yeah, I want that sort of texturized look. I don't want it concaved under or anything like that. So if they're sort of sitting in different directions or straight down, um, sometimes, yeah, if I do want extra straight hair, I will run my straightener through it, but I do find that sometimes when I run my straightener through, it takes out the volume as such, so I find that the blow drying gives me all this nice, big sort of volume through my hair, and then I will just run a bit of hairspray through, and I've been using the same perfectly undone ultra brushable hairspray, and just spray some under in there at the roots. I'll also sometimes put a bit of dry shampoo, um, if it's on second day hair and that's pretty much it now if I do find that my hair is a little bit frizzy it is a little bit today um, 
I usually just grab a little bit of serum, so I don't use too much of this on fine thin hair, it is gonna drag it down. So half a pump. So I'm gonna use the Tony and Guy Glamour Serum Drops. Simply rub it through your hands so it's all distributed onto your hands and just sort of run it through those ends. Just to, and especially this front bit, I've got so many baby hairs in this front bit, just to keep them under control. So basically that's how I blow dry my hair if I want lots of big volume um, in my fine thin hair. <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video guys. Um, a bit of a wacky bit of hair hanging out there at the side. What's it doing? It's not flying. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video guys um, and I will see you in my next one. Bye bye. Oh, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if you want to see more hair tutorials, let me know. Um, yeah, I might do one where I put my really big extensions in and do like a side um, updo. Yeah, so bye guys.